This is the parallel flash tube experiment. There's better ways to do this, but I wanted to use parallel components. So for starts, I have six 300 watt second Xeon flash tubes with an ellipsoidal reflector that I got out of a garbage hopper. It was from a mercury vapor lamp setup that they changed. And I polished it up a little bit. I mounted the tubes on a piece of aluminum plate and I drilled holes in it, put in some plastic bushings, and then the tube electrodes slip into that. That's the back side of the plate with the electrodes and their electrical connections. I know it seems silly to run a bunch of parallel tubes instead of one big one, but I had some future projects in mind and I wanted to uh, just experiment with some synchronous uh, switching of some SCRs. So there's the uh, trigger coils, six trigger coils, six SCRs, discharge capacitors. So the base of this project is, I'm using an LM3914 bar graph IC. And the bar graph is the voltage indicator. And on the last segment, instead of lighting up the last LED, I use a um, optocoupler. And then the output of that triggers a 555 timer chip set up as a one shot. And that triggers all the SCRs, which triggers the flash tubes. The resistors there is a divider network for the high voltage lead that I use for the voltage sensor with an adjustable multi-turn trim potentiometer on the bottom to make the final adjustments. Well this here is just a power supply for the board. At the moment I trigger the flash tube with 400 volts on the capacitors. I can adjust that with that multi-turn pot right there. About 400 volts, 1500 microfarads, we're looking at 120 watt seconds of energy per tube. We're now set up for some demonstrations. Here's our bar graph. There's our power supply in operation. After about five flashes, these charging resistors get quite hot. I do need a better charging system for this. Great. Okay, next we're going to do some nighttime shots.
I'll have to apologize for that minuscule flash, but my camera just can't record it very well. Thanks for watching.